Hello, welcome back to another uh, Jax tutorial. Today we're going to learn how to sign PDF documents. Signing PDF documents is important nowadays because of the pandemic, so we have to sign documents electronically. Now one way to do that is to simply attach an image to our PDF document but that does not guarantee the authenticity quote-unquote authenticity of our signature so it is best that if we can attach what we call a digital signature to our documents to somehow authenticate our signature so that's what we're going to do here today in this tutorial we're going to need the adobe acrobat reader dc which is the main tool that i am using to sign uh, pdf documents so let's get started. So the first thing that you need to do or that we need to do is to create our signature specimen image. So we can do that using paint. And I have here resized the image. Okay. So I am now going to create my signature. So let's say, let's pretend that I am Bruce Wayne and I'm going to create the signature for Bruce Wayne. So, by the way, I'm using a tablet, drawing tablet, so to make it easier for me to write the specimen. So let's say B Wayne. So this is now my image signature specimen. Now the next step is to save this as a JPEG file. So a JPEG picture. So I will save this on the desktop. So let's let me name it as B Wayne. Okay, so we have here B Wayne image on the desktop. So the next step is to convert this to a PDF file. Now Acrobat Reader requires that the signature specimen be in PDF format, so we can easily convert this using online tools. So I already have here open this tool, I love pdf.com, so I can just uh, select the image. And then uh, for the size, I'm going to use the fit same page size as image to remain to maintain the size of the signature specimen and then convert this to pdf and then i can download the pdf to the desktop so there is already a pdf file but we can overwrite that so this is the original uh, image specimen for the signature and this one is the PDF image. Now, let's open a document, PDF document that we want to sign. So I have here a sample PDF document. So this is a handout for ComSci uh, 125. So to enable uh, the creation of the signature, we go to the tools and then we create, we click uh, certificates. So tools, certificates, and then the toolbar. On the toolbar, there will be a different set of options. So the we select digitally sign, and then you will have a message like this, and then you select the area where you want to place the specimen, signature specimen. So I have no uh, specimen here yet, so I will create a new digital ID. So the first the next step so i will select the third option create new digital id and then i will save it to file then continue so let's say my name is bruce wayne organizational unit let's say gotham city And the organization name is Wayne Wayne's Enterprises. And then my email is bwayne at 
Gotham dot gov okay you will I, I will let I will suggest uh, the other options remain as is then continue and I can uh, I need to specify the location where the signature will be saved so just use desktop and then just leave it as Bruce Wayne save I have to put in a password let's say Selena then click save the password did not match Selena okay so I now have two identities here so I'm going to select Bruce Wayne and then continue now I have I need to uh, create a new signature specimen because that was a, an old uh, signature so first in this set of options you have to uncheck all of them so that you'll only get an image and then on the toolbar you click image and then you browse then go to desktop and then look for the PDF signature specimen so this is the PDF signature specimen and then we click save so this will be the signature specimen that, that will appear on the PDF document so I can type in the password and then uh, I, I will save this as bwayne and you got the signature here so let's close this document and then let's look at this uh, signed document and you will see here that when you open this document you will see a, a, not, a notification at the top signed and all signatures are valid and when you click this signature this image you will see some indication that the signature is valid and you can check the properties of the signature the, valid, the validity of the signature and additional information like this one so Bruce Wayne Gotham City uh, and all the details about the document so this way you are able to validate the signature of the of the document of the individual who signed the document you can look you can click on the signature panel and you will see here the uh, list of signatures that who signed on this particular document so that's basically it so i hope you enjoy the tutorial and i hope that you're going to utilize it when signing documents that you submit to the to other individuals or entities thank you very much